The British government wants to renegotiate the deal with the EU, is my understanding. Your party won an election on the strength of the deal going ahead. The government signed the deal. Shouldn't we just honour it now? So, with the um, Northern Ireland Protocol, uh, obviously nobody had any idea uh, the actual effects of it until it, uh, we left, Bre we left uh, the EU. So we had to look at how it operated um, after we left the EU. We've looked at it, there have been difficulties with it, and we think that it's not satisfactory as it is. So we want to be in a situation where we can actually renegotiate it. Uh, the Northern Ireland Protocol isn't written in, in stone. It's not something that was going to last forevermore. Everybody realised at the time. It's been just a few months. And also, when it's you say nobody knew... Months. No one knew. Am I not right in saying that at least three previous Prime Ministers warned that this would happen? Nobody could guarantee, I should, I should have been more careful with my words, nobody could guarantee what would happen until it actually uh, happened and we'd left the, the EU. I think that what we've seen is that the EU have been a bit inflexible uh, on, the, on the protocol uh, and we want to be able to see if we can make it work more smoothly. A deal's a deal, though, isn't it? A deal is a deal. Um, it was but, signed. But, it's not, but it wasn't something that was going to last for, in, in, forever. Nobody thought... Uh, that the Northern Ireland Protocol was going to define the, the, the role of Northern Ireland and it, within, uh, within the UK forever, evermore. It was something that was, was flexible and we wanted to make it work more smoothly.